Bahama Rock, operating under Martin Marietta, is an American-based company and a leading supplier of aggregates and heavy building materials. The Minister of Labor, the Honorable Dion Folks, along with the delegation, toured that facility to speak with employees and to gain an understanding of operations. Minister Folks says he is very pleased with the ratio of Bahamians and non-Bahamians at the company. We have approximately 86 full-time employees of which 82 are Bahamian and four are non-Bahamian. We also have vendors that cater to Bahama Rock, and that represents about 10 additional persons. So in total, there are 92 um, Bahamian employees here and four non-Bahamians. I think that's probably one of the best ratios that, um, that, 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 that I have seen in a very <clears throat> long time. General Manager Lance Brown says that the company is very pleased to work along with the various agencies under the Department of Labor, which help in facilitating the training of and placement of Bahamian employees. He says they fully understand the importance of being an integral part of the Bahamian community and economy. We are excited about the opportunities that we bring to the island and our training that we do with um, the um, BNT, with uh, the NTA and so on and so forth. We, we've, we've done quite a bit of training and we, um, we, we've uh, hired quite a few of those individuals as well. And so um, the, the sponsorship there is, is something that we, we enjoy doing and we know that the youth are, are very important to the success of this island and for the, for, for the country. Members of Parliament, Pakisha Parker Edgecombe and Aram Lewis, also are part of the delegation. They both commended the company for their community outreach efforts. When we think of corporate citizens, particularly those of this magnitude, our, our mindset is always that we want to have opportunities for our labor force. And I think that Bahama Rock uh, precisely does that for us. I can say that quite a number of the constituents of West Grand Bahama and Bimini um, has benefited as a result of being employed at this establishment and for that we are very grateful and we look forward to future growth. I can speak to the fact that they are community oriented and uh, we appreciate what they're doing now and we anticipate a long lasting relationship where the Bahamas will continue to, Grand Bahama in particular, will continue to be built um, in partnership with companies like Bahama Rock. Megan Shepard. Set an ass. Network News.